Hey, how you doing? Stuart Beebe here, and thanks ever so much for watching. I truly appreciate you being here. Now, if you've ever been asked to take a picture of a large group, you'll appreciate actually how difficult and tricky it can be, really, to, to make it perfect. Uh, but for me, when we're talking about a large group, it doesn't necessarily mean about perfecting everybody's pose and look. It's really about creating that kind of fun atmosphere and environment for everybody in the group that had the picture to remember it by. Earlier on this year, we was asked by our local school here in Sudbury, if, they, if we would take a picture of the entire school in the shape of a rainbow. It was a lot of fun. I thought it'd be a great idea to take along the camera crew uh, to film an episode. So come along with us. I hope you enjoy it. Cue the intro. So today's assignment is uh, all the children in the school are going to be lining out just over here and forming the shape of a rainbow. Now each grade will be in, uh, set in their different colours of the rainbow, which is going to be really fun. Now the thing that came to mind, I thought, well, we're going to shoot it with a drone. But um, honestly, I mean, I have a drone and I thought, you know, do I really want to fly around a school of, uh, of children? Not really. I want to be kind of, you know, safety comes first, right? So, of course, uh, it, the drone really wasn't an option. So the next best thing was to get up there on the roof, which is where we're going to, get to shoot today. Okay, so we've just seen the, uh, the caretaker. He said he's, uh, he's already for us so we can uh, get up on the roof. I think he said this way. Or... Start it up. Seen the, uh, the care taxi, so we can go up there now. Okay, so here we are. So uh, we climbed up to uh, two stories. It's really hot up here, very hot. The sun beating down, all this reflection. But uh, we made it. So all we've got to do now is set up the shot and get ready for the children to come out. Uh, get start talking on this. this is, I'm, I'm just excited about talking on this thing and anything else. Can you hear me over? Yeah, we've got all the kids now, they're all lined up out here. So, Pinoy School, they've had this playground here for 17 years, and today they're actually going to start breaking up and they're going to be replacing the, uh, the, the playground with a new one. So, that's really what this event's all about today. As you can see, they're all kind of all in their different colours of the rainbow. After that started, we're going to move over to here to do the, uh, the, the big rainbow shot. So, we're going to get in position and do that. But, uh, yeah, this is exciting. Hi, how are you doing? They've uh, set up the construction here. You can see the shape of the rainbow now and actually how tight it is onto the, onto the fence. So again, what we're going to do is that the children are all going to line up in the formation and then we're going to get them to shift along about sort of three, four, maybe five feet so that we don't have to deal with this uh, fencing in post. I want completely green either side. So my facilities manager is getting very nervous here up there without a harness. So can you just please make sure to stay back from the, from the edge so it makes everybody feel safer? Yeah, of course, absolutely. Yeah, we're about we're about four feet from the edge here, anyway. To be fair, it looks closer, but we're about four feet away. Okay, he's, just, he's a little nervous, so I'm just trying to make him feel better too. Absolutely, I got that. Thank you for the concern. Yeah, so looking at the setting back where we stood here, we definitely need to move the children across, probably about 10, 15 feet actually, because I'm around about 60 mil at the moment, and uh, that that just gives me pure green grass and all the kids in their colours. So we definitely need to shift them along. So that's why we've got the walkie-talkie, so we can kind of keep in, uh, eat, in a nice conversation with them. Because that's where they're going to take our picture from, because we're going to go stand in the shape of a rainbow. Great organisation from the school. So, Kristen? So what we'll do, we'll do, we'll certainly do one shot here, and then if we can, we'll see how the move goes. Okay, so we'll do, a, we'll do a shot like it is. Is everybody ready? Okay, so they're, they're going to try and move them out. It's going to be quite a task. It's just taken about 20 minutes to get them all in in place. So I've suggested that we do one shot as they are, and if, if it doesn't work out, it doesn't work in terms of the move. It doesn't work out. It doesn't work out. But at least we'll get the shot as it is. Okay, you're going to go for the big move now, so we'll see what happens here. Here we go. Keep 
it probably would have been better just to move the cones. Uh, we kind of went with the idea of moving the children after, but I think it would have been easier moving the cones first. But um, well, they're a good bunch of kids. They're a great school, great teachers. So uh, if anybody can do it, those teachers can. Did you see? How close are we to where we need to be? You're very close. You're very close. That looks much better, doesn't it? This is going to be much better like this. I think that's good. All we've got to do is tight. I mean, this, this side here is perfect. Perfect. We've got to kind of tighten that up a bit. Just move everybody closer. Tighten it up into there, yeah. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good. All we've got to do is push those kids back in. That's it, there, there, there. So where you are, Julie, where you are there, Julie, the kids around you just got to move back two feet. That's it. That's it. That's good. This is looking as good as it can be, I think. Why they go? Way. Okay, so that went really well. Good job everybody, that's great. That was awesome. It didn't quite end up quite as a perfect rainbow as it was initially, but I tell you that's gonna end up a much better shot. And uh, yeah, they did a good job. So, end of it. Let's, uh, we have to climb down now. So as you can probably see, we really enjoyed uh, filming that episode. It was a lot of fun and uh, we felt very honoured to be part of that special day. I want to give a big thumbs up and a thank you to uh, all the staff and volunteers at uh, Peter Noyes School. You did an excellent job. Uh, also for Matt Cranston uh, from Subway TV who made this episode possible. And also, again, thanks to you for watching. I really hope you've enjoyed this episode. Please remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Was it